So we have a totally occluded catheter. We have our TPA on one syringe, and one syringe and our empty 10 cc syringe here. So first we are going to aspirate on the empty syringe back to the seven to nine cc mark. And we are going to turn the lever off towards that syringe and let the plunger go. The hope is that a small amount of the TPA in this syringe is going to get sucked into the catheter. So we'll keep repeating that same motion. Once all the TPA gets into the empty syringe, then we basically um, do the same, same, um, same repetition, but we swap the syringes. So now we'll pull back on that syringe and turn it off, and the hope is that a little bit of the TPA in here will suck in. This can take a long time, so we usually work on it for five to 10 minutes give it a little break and then keep coming back to it. If the patient is cooperative, you can keep the stopcock attached, but they are, if they're little and gonna be running around and grabbing at it, then you might need to disconnect and just reattach the stopcock each time to the line.